my channel with St. Patty's Day coming up this week. I decided to do a tutorial on how to get this green glittery eye um, just by using eye candies glitter. Um, so I'm going to show you guys this tutorial. I am already going to complete one eye and then show you how I do the other eye and then I'll also just show you like a quick um, base makeup look too. So keep watching and I will show you guys how to get this look. Okay, so I have one eye done just so that you can see this eye completely before I go on to this eye. Um, so first I'm going to start with my transition color. So I'm going to be using my Morph 35K palette and I'm taking this shade right in here and I am putting this above my crease and just working it all on top of the lid or above the lid. I should say. Next, I'm going in with my Coastal Scents palette. It's really dirty. I apologize. I've had it since cosmetology school. But I'm going in with this dark green shade right in here. And I'm just going to place this in the crease and kind of blend that upward. And I'm going to go back in with that transition color. And I'm just going to go on top and just make sure those two colors are blended together. So I'm going to take this shade of brown right in here. And I'm going to put that right in the crease. Next, I'm going to take from this... Urban Decay Moon Dust Palette. This light year shade right in here. You can see that. This is going to give our eye candy glitter a little bit of a pop. Now we're going to get rid of any extra eyeshadow and create a sharp line. I'm just doing that with face lotion and a Q tip. And I'm going to clean up any extra eyeshadow with that. Next, I'm going to go in with my In the Village Felt Tip Liner. And I'm going to apply my eyeliner. Can you guys see that? Okay, now here is the tricky part. This is the part where I'm applying glitter. So I'm going to use my Clear Duo Lash Glow. And I'm just going to put it on a little um, mixing palette. Alright, you're going to dab a Q-tip right into the glue. And you're going to dab it right on top of your lid above the line. We are using eye candy glitter. And we're just going to place that right on top of the glue. And just dab that down. All right. Just like that. Next, you're going to go in with your mascara. I am taking the black duo glue and I'm applying this to my more flashes. They're my favorite. And after they dry a little bit, you can apply more mascara to them if you'd like. So now we can begin to do the face. I am going to start with a luminous primer on my cheeks. Okay, now I'm going to use the Laura Mercier um, Silk Cream Moisturizing Photo Edition Foundation. Um, 
I love this foundation, but I hate the tube that it comes in. I wish it came in like a pump tube or something. All right, so I'm going to apply that all over my face. use my um, toothbrush makeup brush and I'm gonna blend all that in now I'm gonna do under my eyes I'm using the Maybelline instant age rewind concealer so I'm gonna apply that all under my eyes and then I will blend it with my beauty blender It's for under your eyes, but I use it like regular concealer. So I put it on my forehead, above my lip, on my chin. Now with your damp sponge, you're going to blend that all under your eye. And with the other side of that beauty blender that I got from In The Village, I'm going to take the translucent powder and just apply that under my eyes. Okay. You can either let that bake or you can just wipe it off right away. Um, I don't really need it on, so I'm just gonna wipe it off. So we just set the makeup. Now for my Morph Cool Concealer Palette, I am taking this shade right here. This shade is going to contour. It's definitely a cooler shade, so it kind of shadows all those unwanted areas out a little better. Then I'm going to take a different damp beauty blender and I'm going to blend all that. And then with the same beauty blender that you use for your concealer, you can just kind of blend that in. Taking this NYX Ombre blush, and this is in shade Strictly Chic. So I'm really just going to use a tiny bit right on my cheeks. Next I'm going to use a bronzer to go over the contour and this is just one from MAC that I have. So I'm going to take my bronzing brush and I'm just going to get in there really good and go over anywhere that I contoured with cream. Next I'm going to take my Anastasia Glow Kit I'm take this shade Snow with my fan brush and I am just going to apply this right on top of my cheek on both sides and above my lip my chin and like you can do a little bit on your forehead so we're gonna finish our eyes by applying a green shade as an eyeliner so I'm gonna go back to that dirty coastal sense palette that I use any brush like this pencil brush that I have here and I'm going to use that same green shade. And I'm just going to go right under my bottom lashes. Thing on the other side. And I'll do my bottom lashes. I'm going to use Naked that I got from In The Village. It's a lip liner, but... I think I'm going to use it as a lipstick. I'm going to spray with NYX Setting Spray. Alright guys, that was my 2017 St. Patty's Day eye and face tutorial. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope that you enjoyed the video. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't already and hopefully next week I will have another video for you guys. Yeah.